Whoa, okay, we're gonna drift around this corner. <laughs> I got on the grass again. What's going on guys, my name is Matidio and welcome back to Gran Turismo Sport where today we have some new DLC in the game because the, uh, the the festive update has been added to the game today and there's quite a lot of new stuff uh, to this. Um, some of the big stuff being obviously we have 12 brand new cars in the game, things like you know we've got an R34, an R32 Skyline, we've got the VW Samba bus, there's a Ferrari F40 and other things in there. But the big thing, of course, is we now have a proper sort of career mode, which is basically the GT League, uh, as you can see here. So, um, lots of different cups. We're going to be jumping into some of this in a moment. Um, but yeah, like I said, really happy to see this stuff back in here because this was one of the big things that was missing from Gran, um, Gran Turismo because it's, it's been such a mainstay through all the other games that not to have it is was really disappointing but they've listened to the community uh, and the fans and we basically we have it so that's awesome so we're going to get into that in a moment um like i said we have some uh, some brand new cars in the game as well so we've got a mazda rx7 um f 150 pickup uh, a couple of nissan skylines like i mentioned a suzuki swift uh, Chevrolet Corvette Stingray, um, Chris Holstrom's um, 1967 Chevy Nova, which I think won a competition back in, I think it was SEMA, is it? Was it SEMA? In 2013, I think it was, I remember reading. Uh, as I said, the, the Volkswagen Samba bus, uh, Ferrari F40, the Ferrari Enzo, Lamborghini Countach LP400, uh, the 1974 model, I'm assuming, uh, from that, and the KTM Expo R from 2012. And also we've got a uh, a new um, driving course, which this look. I mean, I remember this course, but this is basically. I think this is an expansion. So we've got yeah, yeah. It is. It's Yamagira and Miyabi, which is cool. It's going to give that you make the track that little bit more uh, thing because. As you see, oh, I, can't, I can't really explain it to you because I can't point to show you, but uh, you can see where the track basically connects up. So, yeah, that looks really good. We might give that a try, uh, hopefully. And also we've got some um, season's greetings, um, you know, season, you know, Christmas scapes. That's what I'm looking for. Sorry, I'm just a, a little bit all over the place today. Uh, and also we've got the Bugatti Museum. Nice. But there we go. And uh, so yeah, what we're going to do is we are going to go and jump into some campaign because we've got the GT League now. Uh, we'll start off with the beginner league. Uh, the Sunday Cup, classic of course. And the first one is at the uh, the Northern Isle Speedway. And I'm not quite sure what we're in. So let's, uh, let's see. Jump into the... Ooh, okay. Um, so there's lots of different cars we can choose from. Hmm, what shall we choose? What shall we choose? What shall we choose? You know, I haven't driven this yet. Oh, no, no, we'll go with the Type R. Yeah, we'll, we'll take the Type R. I'm not going to be a, a scumbag and take the Megane because we know what the Megans are like. Um, so we'll take the uh, we'll take the Type R. And, uh, yeah, it's going to be six laps around here. And, um, yeah, see what we can do. Okay, then, guys, here we go. Time to shake and bake. We got a lot of catching up to those six laps and uh, eleven cars to pass. I'm going to take all three of these on the high side. Woo, okay. The steering's very light for some reason. I don't know why. Oh, that was a wall. Well, we're up into uh, second place now. 
And I'm assuming this is the leader just ahead of us. Uh, and there we go, taking the lead. Fairly straightforward, as you would imagine, from this uh, level of competition. Checkered flag. Okay then, guys. So we got the win, and uh, now we get to move on to this one here, this next race, which is the Suzuka East Circuit course. And uh, yeah, let's um, should we choose something different? I think I want to try this. I haven't tried this yet, so we're gonna try this. Oh, we got some more cars down here. No, no, we'll we'll try. We'll try this. We'll try this here, and see what this is like. Okay then. Here we go. Should be fairly straightforward. See, this thing absolutely flies. Why is it letting me use this? <laughs> this is so overpowered. Whoa, Jesus Christ. Come on, bro. That brake check, man. Douche. I don't. I hate the East Circuit. I really do because it just. You know, there's no room. This first part of it isn't built for overtaking. Move, douche. And this car is way too overpowered for this, for this uh, this course and this um, selection of competition, dude. What are you breed checking me for? Right, let's open the taps up and just look at you just flying past. It's not even it's not even a challenge. Oh, okay, we've run it off again. Get oh I hate this bloody stuff. Once you get on the AstroTurf, then it's so bloody difficult to get off of it. Doesn't happen to be bloody hands in the way of the time of the corners, does it? Eh, I can't see. Oh, dude! Breaking so abruptly for. And then he'll. Do he dip the brakes here? No, he won't. I've been stuck behind someone in bloody traffic. So you get a chance to just put the bloody hammer down and go. God, this is terrible driving. Like I said, this car is just way too overpowered and the handling isn't brilliant. And you know, I just, uh, it just really is distracting me the fact that I, my hand's always in the way. Job done. Well. I hate that circuit. Like I said, I hate that circuit. And um, this car's quick. But like I said, why are they letting me choose it? It's so overpowered compared to what I'm going up against. Um, but yeah, there we go. That's that done. Um, hmm. Next race. We need to... Uh, 
Do this. Okay then, so, um, what car should we choose? Because we've got a few cars that we can choose. Um, no, I think I might choose the... Um, should I? No, actually, I'm going to choose the Subaru. We're going to take the Subaru for this one. Because it's the Dragon Trail circuit, and I do like this course. So, we'll take this. It's going to be two laps around here. And, um, yeah, hopefully we can get the win again. Okie dokie, here we go then. We're all the way back in 12th place. We do have a lot of catching up to do, but this is a very long lap. Try and get past both of these. Oh, this 4C might be a little bit of a challenge. But I'm going to risk it for a biscuit. I know that 4C is still on the outside of it. Again, it just feels like it's just way too overpowered, these cars. Whoa, okay. Got on the grass a little bit there. <laughs> the one thing that annoys me about this um, is, you know, while I appreciate the fact that they have added this to the game, I would have liked it to have been, you know, you can almost start a separate career where they give you a small amount of money and you buy a car. And work your way up basically um, but yeah so while it's nice to sort of have this back in to a degree it's just it just doesn't have that same feel where you basically work your way up from the bottom which is what I would have liked ideally but I know I understand it would be difficult because like by this point everybody's got a crap ton of money in their bank account but having proper restrictions on the races would be um, probably a bit handy come here Dubois that's how you pronounce it ooh this 4C's got a bit down the straightest didn't he This is the final lap, of course. I think we might just have him. He's still on the outside of me. Whoa, and he's turning in on me. Well, as long as we don't make any mistakes, I think we should have this one in the bag. This yeah, Subaru is quite nice, actually. I like it. Not the quickest I've been through there. Okay, let's go. Oh, yeah, big lead now, and that's pretty much it.
it's not really much of a challenge, this isn't. I don't know if there's an area where I need to up the difficulty or something, or whether it's just the nature of the cup at this point, the Sunday Race Cup, or Sunday Cup Race, whatever you want to call it. So yeah, there we go. Another win. And, um, hmm, okay, well we got, um, still got a bit of time left, I think. I think we'll do, I think we'll try and get through the last uh, couple of races of the Sunday Cup, I think. Okay then, so it's Al Sachi Village, which um, some of you will remember. Had a bit of a, a bit of aggro there <laughs> in a, uh, in a Manufacturer's Cup race, I think it was, um, a couple of weeks ago. Oh, come on, dude! Are you fucking kidding me, dude? Come on! So, hmm, let's see, what shall we pick? Um... I don't, I don't honestly. I don't know what, should, what we should pick. To be honest, I think maybe yeah, I've got these safety cars. So you know, I'm going to use this safety car. I'm going to use this. Oh no, I can't. Can I not use it? I don't think I can use it actually. It requires tuning apparently. All right, to hell with that then. I'm not going to bother with that. Uh, I think we'll go with. Um, I mean, look at this. Are these? Have I got three of these? These McGann Sports. Are these all my cars? Because look, you got. These are all my cars. Why have I got... Oh, that's the thing with this. Stop giving us the same cars. If you know we have a car, don't offer it in the prize wheel. You know? <laughs> I'm tired of getting the same car that I can't sell. Uh, okay, well, we'll take uh, we'll take this McGann Sport and we'll give that a go. Okay, then. Here we go, guys. And Oh, it's backwards. We're going backwards for this one. And it's at night. I've never done it this way. So it's a different kind of challenge. We're gonna have two laps still. But yeah, I haven't done the uh, the reverse route of this course. I've done the forward one a few times. And he's going off. And this is where that douchebag hit me. Going the other way, of course. Whoa, golf. Trying to make an overtake. Okay, we're going off. We're going off. Get off the grass. Get off the grass. Yeah, it seems even the AI can't stop hitting me around here. You want to make it difficult, bro? I'll go off on the grass and get past you. If you want me to do that. Okay, we're up to third. And then we've got Pablo Hernandez just ahead of us. I'm a Leeds United fan, so P. Hernandez is the first place I'm going to go, in it? <laughs> I've got to run on this Evo. A 
look, it's Molly Grunwald ahead of us. Grunwald? Grunwalder? Whoa, okay, we're gonna drift around this corner. <laughs> I got on the grass again. Back down to a uh, Spanish douchebag corner. So I'm gonna call it from now on. <laughs> Ooh, this might be a little bit difficult to catch this guy, but I'm going to do it. I haven't figured that corner out going the other way. Far away now, right on the back of him. Trying to hang it around the outside. Job done. Not the greatest driving you'll ever see, more than likely, but we got the job done. And across the line, job done. Yeah, another gold trophy. I don't like this music as much. The victory music for the uh, the racing as much as I like it for the uh, the licenses. <laughs> well, you do your licenses because that music is just epic. That's our Star Wars victory blowjob music. <laughs> I can't remember what I call it then. <laughs> uh, but there we go. That's another one done. And uh, we've got one more left to go. So we can close this and um, head to the final race. Which is the two laps of the Nürburgring. It's better be the standard Nürburgring. I think for the Nürburgring, I need to take something with a little bit extra poke. You know, I'm going to take the Subaru again. I really like the Subaru. So we're going to do the Subaru again. It's going to be the Nürburgring. And it's going to be two laps. And uh, this will be the, uh, the last race, I think, for today. Okay then, guys. Here we go. The final race of the Sunday Cup. And it's going to be two laps of the, um, I think it's the shorter version of the Nürburgring, if I'm not mistaken. No, it's not. It's the full-blown version. Sorry. And we're in our scooby dooby doo Look at this guy trying to... Oh, we've got a yellow flag. Whoa, okay. Jesus, can I just get through any sort of race on Gran Turismo? Be it against humans or AI where I'm not getting bumped. Oh, now we've got to run on these three. Oh, apparently we don't because I'm getting squeezed. And brake checked. Dude, did you see that? Come on, bro. Move, move, move. I'm faster, move. Matinho is faster than you. Move. Cheers. Bye. We've got Team America ahead of us. There we go, a little bit of a switch back. Uh, 
if you look to our right, that's where Lewis Hamilton binned it back in 2007 <laughs> when his tyre exploded. Oh, I will admit, I haven't driven many of the uh, the road cars in this game because, let's face it, they're kind of sluggish and um, more rolls at a bakery. As in the body roll, you know? Never mind. My jokes are terrible. I know this. But we're in the lead, so it should be nice and smooth sailing. And of course, this is the uh, the scene of our first um, GT Sport. It was a Manufacturer's Cup winning a Jaguar. Fond memories. I wonder if there's a way to change the difficulty. Because I'm assuming there isn't, and I'm assuming it's just the difficulty set by the um, by the car restrictions and so on. But I don't know; it just seems so overpowered. Maybe I are racing god. Code. Right. Let's see if I can crack the 37s. patient through this first section of corners but yeah I like this Subaru it's nice I think we should maybe do a few more road cars in the um, in the manufacturers in the nation's cup perhaps I don't think it would work for the Manufacturers Cup, but the Nations Cup definitely. Oh, breaks way too much and way too early there, but oh, we're up by eight seconds. Okay, well, let's see if we can get into the um, I don't know, into the twenties. The two twenties would that be doable? It, ooh, it might be. It's going to be a big ask. But if we can nail the chicane, then maybe we can. To the final corner. I think the 20s might be just be a little bit beyond us. Oh, it was close. Oh, another two tenths of a second. But we won. And that's the Sunday Cup, guys. In the bag. Hopefully I get a nice prize. I think we've just done, we've just done the daily workout. So, that should hopefully mean that we're going to get a prize car. So, uh, yeah, shall we go and see what our prize car is? I think we should, because we've done the Sunday Cup, so uh, that's the end of this episode. Next time we'll come back for the uh, the FF Challenge, and we'll do Clio Cup and um, all these as well. So, yeah, we'll come back and do those in another episode, because there's lots to do, of course. Uh, and the Endurance League, I might save them to do stream, I don't know, maybe, maybe an Endurance um, League stream. Maybe that would be cool. Uh, but yeah, so let's see what our prize car is. Hopefully it's one of the new ones. Give me an F40. Make that an option. No, apparently not. Okay, well the KTM Expo is there and that's a new car, so I'll, I'll take one of those. Or oh, that Aston Martin. Aston Martin it is. Fair enough. Nice. It's the uh, GT3 model, so I'm assuming I could use only Group 3, so that might be something we use in one of our uh, GT Cup races. Uh, sorry, our Manufacturers Cup or Nations Cup races. Uh, but yeah, guys, that's the end of today's episode, so thank you everybody so much for watching. Uh, if you did enjoy, you would like to see more um, 
Gran Turismo or race content from myself, then make sure you hit that like button and subscribe. Uh, but yeah, thank you again for watching. Take care, and I'll catch you all in the next video. Peace.